Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your volume is too low on your Windows 11 computer. So if you notice, it's very hard to hear things on your computer and volume or the sound is very faint. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve that without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing I'd recommend doing would be to go down to your system taskbar and click on your speaker icon. You may have to adjust it to be further up here so you can see there's a scrolling bar here. Go ahead and adjust that. I wouldn't go too high because you might have your speakers already turned up so you don't want to blare them too loud. But maybe just turn it up to like 30 or 40 percent and see if you're able to hear things better and then you can adjust accordingly. Something else too, make sure your actual speakers are turned on. So a lot of speakers have power on or off buttons, especially external speakers. So you want to make sure it's turned on. If you're using something with batteries in them, make sure the batteries are charged or replaced. Make sure they're working properly, basically. And then something else we can try here as well would be to open up the magnify search icon and type in troubleshoot. Best manager come back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to select where it says other troubleshooters. Go ahead and left click on that. And then underneath most frequent, you want to go ahead and select playing audio and then select the run button. And then I would recommend following along with any suggestions it provides here for you. So I just said no, but you can select yes. Again, that's if you want to kind of go based on your recommendations. The same recommendations that you get will not probably be the same that I get. So I don't really want to go any one direction too far. It's Again, they walk you through it pretty clearly on the screen here. So hopefully I would have been able to resolve the problem. I don't have an issue. That's why you know it's saying it couldn't identify the problem. But I think the first couple things I said about checking your system audio down here, as well as checking your physical speakers, make sure they're turned on, that should resolve the problem for a vast majority of you guys. Also, make sure your speakers are plugged in properly to your computer. So it kind of goes back to the power. So some um, speakers might have a power cord as well as a connection to your computer. So they might be getting power, but they're not properly connected or configured with your device. Make sure they are properly plugged in. So if there's a USB connection, make sure it's plugged in. You may want to unplug and then plug it back in and then see if that resolves the problem. Or you may also have bad speakers just to begin with. So that's certainly something you want to consider there as well. But pretty straightforward process, guys. And one further thing we can try here, if you open up the search menu and type in CMD, best results should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. And into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC, followed by a space, forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter the keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient.
Okay, so once that's done, close out of here, and you want to restart your computer, so I'm just going to right-click on the Start button, select Shut Down or Sign Out, and then I'm going to select Restart. Okay, so hopefully I was able to resolve your problem, guys. And as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.